Welcome to today's video where we'll be discussing the differences between 8-bit and 10-bit monitors for gaming. As gamers, we know the importance of a high-quality display in our gaming experience and choosing the right monitor can make all the difference. In this video, we'll be breaking down the advantages and disadvantages of each option and help you make an informed decision on which one is the best for you. So, let's get started. Let's start by defining what 8-bit and 10-bit monitors are. The term bit refers to the number of bits used to represent each color channel of an image. An 8-bit monitor uses 8 bits for each color channel which allows it to display 16.7 million colors. On the other hand, a 10-bit monitor uses 10 bits for each color channel which allows it to display over a billion colors. Let's now look at the advantages and disadvantages of using an 8-bit monitor for gaming. Firstly, 8-bit monitors are more affordable than 10-bit monitors. They are also widely available and come in a range of sizes and styles. Additionally, an 8-bit monitor is suitable for most gaming needs, as it can display a wide range of colors and shades. Disadvantages One of the main disadvantages of using an 8-bit monitor for gaming is that it may not be able to display subtle color gradations as accurately as a 10-bit monitor. This can result in banding or color artifacts, especially in darker scenes. Additionally, 8-bit monitors may not be as suitable for professional color critical work such as photo or video editing. Let's now turn our attention to the advantages and disadvantages of using a 10-bit monitor for gaming. The primary advantage of using a 10-bit monitor for gaming is the ability to display a wider range of colors and shades. This can result in more accurate and realistic images, especially in darker scenes or areas with subtle color gradations. Additionally, 10-bit monitors are more suitable for professional color official work, such as photo or video editing. Disadvantages One of the main disadvantages of using a 10-bit monitor for gaming is the cost. 10-bit monitors are typically more expensive than 8-bit monitors and they may not be as widely available. Additionally, not all games and graphics cards support 10-bit color depth, which means you may not be able to take full advantage of the monitor's capabilities. Now that we have looked at the advantages and disadvantages of both 8-bit and 10-bit monitors, you may be wondering which one is the best for you. If you are on a budget or don't need the highest color accuracy, an 8-bit monitor may be the way to go. They are more affordable, widely available and suitable for most gaming needs. However, if you are a professional or serious gamer who values color accuracy and realism, a 10-bit monitor may be the better option. They offer a wide range of colors and shades, which can result in more accurate and realistic images. Ultimately, the decision comes down to personal preference and what you are looking for in your gaming monitor. It's important to consider factors such as color accuracy, budget and compatibility with your graphics card when making your decision. Both 8-bit and 10-bit monitors have their advantages and disadvantages when it comes to gaming. 8-bit monitors are more affordable and suitable for most gaming needs, while 10-bit monitors offer higher color accuracy and are more suitable for professional color critical work. It's important to consider your individual needs and preferences when choosing between the two. We hope this video has helped you make an informed decision on which option is best for you. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video.